So memory market is a very interesting market. It's growing very rapidly right now just because of the need for memory in every electronic gadget, be it your smartphone, tablet, or any high-end electronic item. You need memory, whether it's DRAM or NAND. It's kind of consolidated between three large manufacturers right now. Between the three of them, they have almost 85 to 90% of memory manufacturing. It's an exciting area because there's a lot of advancements going on in high bandwidth memory and some other things that are going on. And memory modules are becoming more and more important. The problem they ran into in this industry is while the IO check is being done, you are essentially everything is being done robotically right now. There is no human intervention. Parts are still literally warm coming off oven. And when you are shoving them with a robot into a physical interface and then pulling it out, some things get displaced and die shift and many other components shift. And they were having problems where everything looked good in IO check, but by the time the customer got the memory module, something was not working. And that becomes a massive problem and headache for these companies. So really they needed a final inspection step which is where the final vision inspection comes in to make sure that nothing has been damaged during the IO check. So everything that is passing the IO check is also good visually. No components are missing. No parts are displaced in some ways. And that is really where FVI comes in. It serves tremendous value in making sure the yields are high when the parts are being received at the customer end and you haven't shipped bad quality parts. Certainly you don't want any part to end up in the field where it fails because that's a catastrophic failure at that point. Um, so you want to correct the problem as soon as you can to minimize any wastage, improve yield, improve productivity. MX3000 leverages our MRS, multi-reflection separation sensor technology. That is our 3D state-of-the-art technology where we have a unique combination of speed and accuracy and resolution all at the same time. It also enables us to inspect very shiny components by suppressing some of the noise signals that we get. That's where our MRS algorithms come in. So yes, memory module inspection system very much leverages MRS sensor technology and all the benefits that MRS brings to the table. Uh, if, if no inspection is done, uh, there is a good chance that a customer is going to receive a memory module that is not working quite right, even though it passed the I.O. check before it left the factory. And that's a significant problem for memory manufacturers, that everything looked okay in their factory, but by the time the customer got it, it wasn't okay. And that's really where MX3000 comes in. MX3000 can inspect the final part visually without touching anything, make sure all the components are there, make sure all the parts look correct uh, visually, uh, there is no abnormality of any sort, and it increases their yield and productivity quite a bit and reduces the defect to zero. So we got into memory module inspection systems a few years ago. Uh, up to, until then, uh, memory manufacturers were primarily using manual labor to inspect memory modules before they were being shipped. Uh, typically on a memory line, you would find anywhere to 15 to 20 operators visually inspecting a high-end memory on bo both sides before they packed it up in a plastic bag and shipped it out. It was kind of a funny sight to see where all this high-tech robotics and automation is coming down finally to a human being looking at the part on bo in both si directions before they ship it out. And that's really where MX comes in. We got into this business with our 2D MX600 system a few years ago. We have sold multiple systems and to one of the large three manufacturers, they are getting tremendous return on that investment, as well as we got the other second large manufacturer now using our MX3000 3D system. You need 3D because 3D enables you to give you some catch you defects that 2D cannot do, like lifted leads and those kinds of things. So MX is doing very well in, uh, in a couple of the large manufacturers and we expect it to continue to do well. MX is a very important uh, product for the company. It already is contributing significantly uh, to the company. So long as we continue to deliver a very good, high performance product at a reasonable price point, I believe we have the market right now, basically for ourselves.